That's a really cool guy. That's going to save your hairline. And by the way, he did all this. He's got a podcast. This guy's got a podcast. So he was hoping that people would start listening to his movie-themed podcast by doing this. And now he's got credits on screen. Eric Mulder. So there you go. That's the guy's name, Eric Mulder. He says, Red Bar Live is not just a new episode. Okay, what is it? It's an event and should be treated as such. Okay, well, you're a dork and you should be treated as such. They done hoodooed me. <laughs> All right, oh, there you go. I don't know, man. This is what they're up to. That's what they're doing. This is what they all have to... Oh, by the way, I forgot to... Um, let's get rid of the... Uh, sorry, I don't remember how to do anything anymore. Let's get rid of the big board. Bye, big board. And let's go back over to this screen. I forgot to tell you about this. This is something I need to show you. Uh, we have a new feature of the moon base. I'm sweating. <sighs> look away. Look away. Look away. All right. There's a new feature of the moon base now, and uh, I don't know if you noticed a difference, but we've got a new feature here. It's here in this area somewhere. Let me explain this for a second. So speaking of polluting the net, speaking of, you know, making, pumping the fake numbers, Red Bar doesn't do anything without first seeing somebody else do it first. Um, and he copies all of the people that are the biggest names in what he makes fun of. Howard Stern, Opie and Anthony, Man Cow. <laughs> um, who else? I don't know. Joe Rogan. So Joe Rogan. I don't know if you guys have ever noticed this. The entire internet is now littered with these clips. You, on your YouTube recommended feed, everything is just clips of shit that you're not interested in. I tell YouTube every single day, not interested in the ne in the 50th Sam Hyde clip channel, not interested in the 500th Red Bar clip channel. These are just the ones I know you guys know. I get clip channel shit like that all the time. And the first one I ever noticed years and years ago was Joe Rogan. I don't watch Joe Rogan. I'm not interested in it. I'm certainly not interested in the man's clips. He's a sentient pile of deli meat. And at some point, Somebody in his organization had the bright idea. They go, you know, this guy, you know, I was just thinking, uh, this, I was about to say, Joe Rogan, this guy's trying to fill three to four hours with good content, and he can't do it. Like, it doesn't matter how many Jewish guests he brings on, Leather Apron Club. Sorry, we did the numbers. It's not anti Semitic there. The numbers are clear as day there, okay? It's, in fact, it's one of the few clear Jewish numbers out there. He can't make Eric Weinstein entertaining for three to four hours. So somebody had the bright idea to do clips of his show, and they're all clickbait. You click on them uh, because the title looks really good, and they've got this very specific type of thumbnail. I think everybody knows what I'm talking about here. It's got Joe on there. It might have the guest on there. And then in the middle, whatever they're talking about, is on the screen, or not on the screen, it's on the uh, on the thumbnail, and it's highlighted in a green box, right? You, we've all seen this, and then everybody started ripping that off. So now, like, Andrew Schultz has thumbnails like that, and, um, and Red Bar was doing thumbnails like that. Actually, hang on a second. Let me, um, let me just grab, I don't know, let me grab an image of Red Bar here for a second. Oh, I had my video open on a tab. That's bizarre. All right, let me just go red bar. Now watch this. This is a cool new feature of the show that I thought of. I invented this. Um, hang on a second. I didn't think this part through, though. Let me just find a random image of Mike looking like a doofus. Here we go. That was easy to find. Open image. Uh, oh, my God. It's so tiny. Is this from Instagram? Yes. Yes, it's from Instagram. That's why it's so tiny. Why is it so, so tiny? Whatever. Whatever. We'll just blow it up. Bad quality. There we go. Okay, now watch this. Look at this. 
So I'm talking about red bar. Now it's got the green box around what I'm talking about. So this is now, I bought this TV as a joke. I haven't even know. I didn't even know why I had this the whole time. You're just supposed to watch the show on the big board, basically. But then I accidentally bought a TV that was way, way too big. You know, this TV is gigantic. It makes the big board look small by comparison, almost like. It's not helping out with the visuals here, but I spent too much money on it. I basically bought this TV to make fun of Mersh. And so I was like, okay, I guess I got to use it. It's way too big, but I guess I have to use it. So I installed this screen in the moon base. And the whole time I haven't known what to do. 